just threw all the bouquets from my boyfriend in the trash. I met Rick on a dating site and fell in love. Liz was against it. She took my phone and hid it from me. She said the internet was teeming with liars. I defended Rick. A beggar wouldn't give me those bouquets. But Liz didn't give my phone back. Then Rick showed up at the door. I didn't answer his calls, so he came to find out what was wrong. Liz wanted to chase Rick away, but I stepped in. Rick and I spent the day together, and he proposed to me. But the cops ruined our fun. Liz stole the car. I found Liz on her dad's grave with a bouquet of blue roses. Her dad taught her how to grow them with ink. Liz showed four of Rick's online profiles. In each one, he wrote a different bio, but I ignored this. I had bigger fish to fry, like getting my stolen car back. I sorted it out with the police, brought Liz home, and dialed Rick. He'd never seen the profiles, saying they must be fakes. I believed him. The next day, Rick came over again. But our date was interrupted by a phone call. Rick's son had an accident. He needed surgery. Rick sold his car, but still needed money. I gave Rick my savings, but Liz went on a hunger strike. She said she'd eat when I stopped dating a fraud. I believed Rick. We wanted to tie the knot when his son got better. But Rick said he needed more money. He begged me to mortgage the house and lend more money for his son. I agreed. Rick sent me another amazing bouquet, but I was shocked. The bouquet opened my eyes to my daughter. Two days later, Rick came for the money I got from my mortgage. But officers were waiting for him. Liz was right. I'd fallen victim to a suave con man. All this time he gave me flowers from the cemetery. Rick worked there and collected fresh gray bouquets. I realized this when I got blue roses from him. The same ones Liz grew and left on her father's grave. Rick was arrested and I kept apologizing to Liz. She forgave me and signed me up for an internet safety course. I recently met a nice man. Liz likes him too. Trust is important, but safety comes first. Agreed?